Alright guys, what's up? Al from It's Android World here. Today taking a look at the new donut by Lazlo ROM that I just found. And it is by far the sexiest donut ROM you will ever flash onto your phone. It is so gorgeous. Um, I can't even begin to describe it. Let's go ahead and take a look at the actual ROM. Starting with the lock screen that's about to show up. Um, so you guys know I have the ENG SPL and I have absolutely no partitioning. It's just a stock FAT32 um, SD card pre-installed on my phone right now. And that's what I'm using. Again, this is for the G1 and my Touch 3G. Here's the lock screen. You can see it looks kind of nice. Got the little green accent down there. Notification bar, T-Mobile, time, date, on time, date, screen lock, and the charging if your phone is plugged in. Tap menu to unlock. That's the stock analog clock included with it. And that's the little application drawer that you can tap to open up. You can see how smooth it runs. And again, you can grab it and swipe it up as well. You can see the sequence in the background, hopefully, um, of the application drawer. And I have not downloaded not one of these applications on here, so that's a nice little feature. And you can see how fluid it is. Um, here's the notification bar. You can see it's a nice little rectangle across top. And you got your 3G um, signal, your battery, and the date. And that just swipes down. You can see it's like nice black transparent. You can see what it looks like when you have notifications. It looks so nice. Um, really, really good looking. Um, and you can see you have the five home or three home screens, excuse me. Um, there's not five home screens on here. So if, if that was something you used, then I guess you're gonna have to not have it. Let's go ahead and launch Roman Calculator, and you can see it is the Eclair calculator. And we'll take a look at the clock. And you can see it's the um, new Android 2.1 clock. Um, and we'll take a look at the dialer has a really nice dialer and you can see up on top it, it's just such an elegant theme um, it's like completely completely themed everywhere and it's really fast up on top you see that right there and I believe when you tap on one it'll highlight green yeah so you know really cool features there and of course the contacts is um, I'll go ahead and show you guys the contacts right now alright guys so here's the contacts tab right here you can just flick through it you can see right there that's pretty much it to the contacts and favorites and um, we'll go ahead and take a look at some of the other features. Um, YouTube, I never really show this in videos. It's just the stock YouTube. But I just want to show you guys, like, the font is around the entire ROM. You get this new font. And um, a lot of rectangles, a lot of squares. You can see when I hit search, I get the HTC IME keyboard completely stock. And um, you get that little rectangular YouTube search right there. And that's how it is for every searching. When you go... To type in something, it'll be rectangular. So if I go to compose new message, you can see it's rectangular on there, and it's black, which is pretty cool. And again, there's the on-screen keyboard, and we'll go home. It's just a really good-looking ROM. Like if I launch Gmail and wait for it to sync, you can see like the font looks really nice. And if I launch open an email and show you guys right down there what those tabs look like really really nice and you see the font again really nice font um, which is again pretty cool the wallpaper gallery has quite a few um, inappropriate images I guess you could say so I'm not going to show you guys wallpaper gallery if you guys want to see those um, then you can flash this ROM yourself and hopefully you do because this is a really good ROM I'm not gonna lie it's, it's one of the fastest ROMs I've ever flashed and I've actually been using this as my stock ROM before I started making videos today so it's been my stock ROM show you guys the power control gorgeous like every single theme um, every single thing is like themed and looks really really nice on um, the power control again looking nice and I'll show you guys let's go to search that's the Google search widget again really nice looking like gorgeous it kinda sucks that there's three home screens when you have all these really nice looking widgets um, music you can see it's from Darkstar that music really nice you just tap play and it'll read it to you right there and you can skip a song so that's really cool 
long pressing right here we'll take a look at calendar so nothing changed to cal calendar um, so something to keep in mind you can see that when I actually placed something on the home screen and I long pressed it to delete it which I'll put calendar back on it turns into that really nice red arrows right there and of course that's how you re remove stuff off the home screens take a look at news and weather which is one of my favorite widgets it's made by Google actually and there you go so most ROMs don't let that work perfectly for me but this ROM does another reason why I love this ROM so much it's just really fast and uh, we'll launch open the browser and take a look and see if that has the multi-touch features once I load up a web page and you can see the browser looks really really nice um, you can see it up on top how it has that green progress bar going up on top and when it's loading it's nice and black and rectangular up there like you've seen a lot in the ROM pretty much all around the entire ROM it's what the theme has to offer and again you see the font everywhere it just looks so nice you can see multi-touch is working but very buggy um, but you know it starts to speed up and so it does work and at least it's there and see if it has the 10 megabyte RAM hack pre-installed by typing in SU and you can see again the really nice pop-ups and font and typing in free and hitting enter and yes so it does have the 10 megabyte RAM hack pre-installed without you having to add it on or anything all in all guys it's a fantastic 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 I can't say enough good things about this ROM um, it is my favorite ROM I think um, I really 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 like um, fast test but this is just version 1 and it's already so good um, it has quick boot as well so if you launch that open you can reboot straight to recovery boot loader and everything like that so um, hopefully you guys want to get this ROM on your phone because it's been my stock phone, um, ROM and I'll, last thing I'll show you guys is that it has the um, music application right here and when I launch it up it is the new Android 2.1 let's go ahead and see how to get this on your phone go ahead and um, plug the USB cable into the bottom of your T-Mobile G1 scroll down the notification bar tap USB connected and hit mount and go to your computer alright guys now go ahead and find wherever you downloaded this donut ROM and just go ahead and place it over to the root of your SD card so I've placed it in my video to do ROMs drag it over to the root of your SD card and let it go over it's a 49.7 megabyte ROM so pretty small for such a heavily themed donut ROM which is kinda nice and once that's finished copying over to your SD card safely eject your phone and go back to it alright guys now unplug the USB cable from your phone and reboot into recovery so wait for the preparing SD card logo that pops up right there to go away and then again reboot into recovery which is right here um, again guys I have the new Amon Ra 1.6.2 Care Bear recovery image in green if you guys don't know how to get it I have a video tutorial on my new ch uh, on my channel right here it's Android World and definitely get this new recovery image guys it's phenomenal um, the only drawback is when you actually do something the Care Bear goes away so I'll go ahead and do a full wipe then go back and flash Donut by Laszlo, and I'll get right back to you guys when that's done. Alright, and when it's done, hit Reboot System now and let the phone boot up. Alright guys, and once the phone boots up, you will officially have Donut by Laszlo running on your T-Mobile G1 or MyTouch 3G. Thanks for watching guys. Please rate this video 5 stars, comment, and subscribe, and follow me on Twitter, twitter.com slash AndroidsWorld, and I'll see you guys later.